So for this review, I actually want to do something different. Uh, it's not so much a review, but kind of a, like a brief look back at some of the past videos. I'll put a link in them as well so you can uh, see what you missed. And uh, let's just go ahead and start. The question is, who is first? Let's go with you. First up will be the Grey Hulk. Um, I originally thought that this was... Uh, a bigger figure but it's actually quite small but don't let the size fool you it is full of detail not so much articulation so the next one will be Iron Man uh, the reason I got this one I instantly just love the detail and sculpt that's on this like this came out in 2005 I think I said or 2008 and just it looks perfectly well next to these newer figures Here's a Rage, very simple, you know, actual design, but I'm a sucker for leather jackets, it looks badass, this was a lot of fun posing, uh, definitely might need to pick up a second one, just for the hell of it. Now this one, you probably don't even, it looks completely different, uh, basically did a repaint and kind of sculpted my own Spider-Man head. Um, this head originally was just too small. Again, a lot of detail, just not too much articulation. And of course, last but not least, the Black Ranger. I rated this one super high and still probably one of my top toys that I've reviewed so far. It's perfect. The only thing is like the likeness could be a little bit better, but overall, 10 out of 20. What, that's bad. 10 out of 10. <laughs> so I uh, hope you like this little video um, I'll probably do some more like this in the future with the newer reviews that I have um, I have a count a doctor a turtle a horse I have all kinds of reviews coming up but uh, like I said go ahead and take the time and just go ahead and look back and watch them because actually they're not that bad 